at this point of the season that each guy knows what their role is on the team. That's why you guys have had so much success in the past uh, few games. Yeah, I, I definitely do think so. Everybody is um, filling into their roles. Nobody is really doing anything outside of themselves, and uh, I think that's why um, our success is, is getting is becoming even greater, and uh, it'll keep on becoming even more greater as um, everybody does their roles um, really well. And like I said, we, we're about to play a tough um, two-game road stretch, and uh, I think I think we could pull out two game, both games. So we just gotta be mentally prepared. And after emotional loss to Marshall, were you hoping for a little more energy, a little more something from the team? Yeah. Um, Definitely, and uh, we during uh, shoot around we we just seemed like we were just like walking around a little bit and uh, not being really energetic, and it showed during the um, first half of the game. And we we definitely got in, got our energy back in the second half, and uh, everybody just started um, playing well, playing loose, moving the ball, and that's when we had our best when we were moving the ball and um, passing around. Everybody's getting touches, and that's that's when our offense was very good. As a leader. Was is it tough or frustrating when, when you see that, especially after um, you know coming off of what you guys came off of, that there wasn't that extra you know yeah. jump in your step? Yeah, it, it definitely was kind of tough, and uh, me being uh, more vocal leader this year, just trying to encourage everybody, just, just more, um, trying to give everybody energy. Hopefully, um, they feed off my energy, and uh, eventually it happened. But we gotta we gotta bring it every game, every um, minute of the game, and that's how we're gonna become a really good team. Tell me about this win overall, bouncing back from Marshall and getting back on the winning track. It's a great win, and luckily Marshall wasn't a conference uh, uh, loss, so today we wanted to build our conference record up, and today we moved from 12 to 5th, so that's pretty good for us. You know, we just got to keep winning them to, to get up in uh, the conference standings. Have you ever gotten this many rebounds before in a game? In high school, I got a lot more. <laughs> Most of it has like 22, but never in college. Uh, this is my best re rebounding game by far. Do we expect to see more rebounds from you, or is this just be at the right place at the right time in um, certain place? Now that coach knows I can get 14 rebounds, he's going <laughs> to emphasize that a little more. He's going to be mad at me when I don't get seven or eight. I'm probably going to have to average like seven or eight now because I, because of how I did that tonight. <laughs> Let's talk about the stretch you guys have coming up, two tough road games, Louisville and Cincinnati. Yeah, these are two tough games that we have to have uh, to be a contender in the Big East and if we want to win the regular season title. Uh, we have to get these two. We can't afford any more losses. Uh, we already have five losses, and that's enough for us. We're going to keep moving forward. Okay, so you think these two games are going to decide for you guys from the middle tier to the top tier of the Big East, seeing that both these teams are in the middle tier of the conference? Yeah, this will, these two games will uh, determine if we're going to be one of the better teams in the Big East. So this will be a good test for us, and we'll see where our team is uh, on the road.